welcome to the series of relational database management system myself is fatima rafiq assistant professor abedan amda senior college bca department we have started with the plsql today we will see what is view and how to write a view as we know that plsql is a block using a block structure whenever we are writing a block the block will contain three part when we are writing one of the concept of this is view view is nothing but the virtual table that does not physically exist it is stored in a oracle data dictionary and do not store any data it can be executed when called view is like a virtual table or we can say it is a imaginary table generally whenever we have a very important or crucial data we don't want the user to access it so at that time what we can uh, do we can a uh, we can create a different kind of view for a different users so these view is actually not present physically present but these are the virtual table and where it gets stored it gets stored in the oracle data dictionary it does not store any kind of data only the view are getting stored and whenever we want them we can execute them a view is created by a query joining or a more table if we want more table in the view we can able to join them but if we want only one uh, view to be created by using one single table this is also possible the syntax of writing the view is create view view name then as keyword and the select statement select statement is the statement uh, for a view for which particular table we want which column from our table as a view so we can use a select query here because we already started uh, already study what is select query and how to write it so this is select column name from a table where based on certain conditions so this is the way we can um, create a view let's take one example of creating a view let's consider the student table as we already have a student table let me just check whether i have the student table or i need to create it let me just take the another example which is a demo i'll be creating one table create table demo it will have a did okay instead of demo let me just take primary key then account holder name data type will be variable character 20 then we will take gender it will be a character 6 then we will take uh, like pin number and for this we will take data type as int and it should be unique these are the constraint which we want then semicolon and close bracket table will be created now we will inserting the value actual table i'll be taking value as 1 account number let's take 111 then account holder name is saba then gender is female and then the pin number so i want the pin number as 1234 close bracket give semicolon and enter okay i have used i, I think semicolon over here instead of single quote so i'll be just replacing it with a single quote and here we have created with the first value now i'll be using this as stu then instead of saba i'll be writing sana it is the gender will be same and then here i'll be writing 1 2 3 4 Five, and I'll be entering. So I have another account. Let's put one more value for a um, practical purposes, and I'll be using here Zen. And here I need to check the gender. 
the gender will be male and I'll be taking 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 and 6. Now I will be doing select star from account. See here this account table will give us account number, name, gender and pin number. But in this particular scenario let's consider I don't want the pin number to be uh, accessed by any of the user. So what I can do I can create one view. Uh, the view will have account number, name and gender but it will hide the pin number. So how to write it? We can write create view uh, name of a view. I'll be writing v1 as and then I'll be writing select a number comma a name comma gender from account so now view is created whenever we want to execute the queue uh, view because view is imaginary table and if I want to see a table so the simple query is select star from view name so it is select star from v1 which is the name of my view so see here when you consider this view, this view is containing only the information of account which is containing A number, A name and gender and the pin number will be get hidden from the user so, and this view will, uh, it is a imaginary, it is a imaginary table. This particular view, the statement of this view will get stored in the data dictionary and whenever we require we just need to give a call to the view and it will get executed. By using a view, we can achieve the security, security, uh, security, where or uh, what we can say, yes, security. Whenever the data is uh, uh, present in the table, it will have only access to the authorized user. No other user can able to use it. And uh, because the view, writing the view is very simple, we can write multiple view for a multiple users according to their need. Once the we have used the view, we can drop the view also if you want so what we can use uh, uh, a statement drop view view name whenever you are, you are using this statement it means that the view which we you have created um, will be getting dropped from the database itself so if i now execute select star from v1 so see it giving me an error that table or view does not exist so this view is getting deleted from the database i hope the view is clear to you if you have any difficulty you can write in the comment box